Hi everyone, I'm Diane Applewhite. Today I am making another pot of oxtail soup. That pot I made three weeks ago with the video short was so good, I'm making it again today. Let me show you. This is four pounds of beef oxtails that I have already washed and patted dry. Now I'm gonna season them with some uh, onion powder pretty nicely, about a teaspoon and a half of onion powder, about a teaspoon and a half of garlic powder, about a teaspoon and a half of seasoned salt, Pepper, about a couple of teaspoons of black pepper. I'm gonna get those seasons worked in. I am searing the oxtails over medium heat. And a little oil is just enough oil in here to cover the bottom of the pan. And all I wanna do is to get a nice little brown on it, like this one right here. They are going into my six quart stock pot. I'm adding eight and a half cups of warm water or enough to uh, enough water to cover them. At least eight cups, but this is eight and a half. Now over about medium high heat, I'm going to bring this pot to a bowl. After about 30 minutes, the pot is at a boil. Now I'm gonna turn the heat down to medium. I'm gonna add for seasoning actually one tablespoon this is a half tablespoon so I'm going to add two and that is sweet basil because I like a lot of sweet basil so that's a tablespoon of sweet basil I'm going to add three bay leaves that was a little one so I put four have some minced garlic, cut up garlic cloves I'm putting in here. This is about four or five that I was using up. I'm going to put about a half tablespoon of kosher salt. That's about a half. And two tablespoons sugar to start anyway and I'm going to let this boil over medium heat for an hour or until the oxtails start to become tender this pot has been going for two hours now and I'm almost ready to start adding the other ingredients but before I do I want to show you how I have been um, skimming off some of the fat now there are different ways uh, I imagine to do this but I usually just just take my time and, and skim off some of the, uh, the fat off the top or you can also wait uh, until the it cools down and the grease forms on the top of it and it just will lift off nice and easy. But before I add the other ingredients, I'm just going to skim as much of it off the top as I can. I'm ready to add the rest of the ingredients. I'm adding a can of 
diced tomatoes, petite diced tomatoes. That's a 14 ounce can of diced tomatoes. Get that mixed in a little bit. I'm adding eight ounces of tomato paste. I'm gonna get that stirred in. I think I am going to add another four ounces of the tomato paste because I like my nice, thick, and rich with tomato paste. So I'm actually using 12 ounces, that's a 12 ounce can of tomato paste. After adding the tomato paste and the diced tomatoes, I brought this back up to a boil. I adjusted uh, the seasoning with a couple more tablespoons of sugar. Now I am going to add four cups of mixed frozen vegetables. I'm going to add this, the vegetables. I'm going to get them all mixed in. And I'm going to let this cook now simmer for about 30 minutes. Y'all, I am back and here to tell you that this soup is as flavorful and delicious as the first pot. Look at those oxtails. And the vegetables. I kid you not. Oxtail soup, y'all. Thanks for watching. Like the video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Till next time. Bye-bye.